Our laboratory, led by Professor Matthias Marty here at the University of Glasgow, is focused on the transmission stages of Plasmodium, the parasite that causes malaria. We are a part of the Wellcome Centre for Integrative Parasitology, which is part of the Institute of Infection, Immunity and Inflammation. The Marty lab is now in its 14th year. Uh, after 10 years at Harvard, we moved to Glasgow in 2016. We studied the malaria parasite and uh, its interactions with the host. We do that both uh, under controlled in vitro conditions and in vivo in animal models and in humans. We develop tools to define and characterize phenotypes and study underlying mechanisms. Sometimes our work provides cues for malaria diagnostics or for the development of new interventions, which is of course very exciting. A lot of our research involves in vitro parasite culture, genetics tools, flow cytometry, microscopy, omics, and the development of new techniques. We are a diverse group comprising of individuals with a broad range of skills and knowledge, which is good because we have a lot of different ideas and interests. I'm Christine Langotto, I'm a postdoc and I'm from Kenya. I'm Julia, I'm a postdoc at the Martis Lab. Hello there, my name is Kana. I come from India. I'm Lorian, I'm coming from France. I am mainly interested in finding out how the depletion of the host factor lysopc can trigger sexual commitment in Plasmodium falciparum. For that, I am using genetics tools like uh, CRISPR-Cas9 and as well I'm doing a lot of metabolomic that's required to grow a lot of parasites. Here right now I'm working on the nature of sexual merozoids in Plasmodium. Also I'm trying to establish a pipeline for organs on a chip to study host parasite interactions. I'm investigating the role of a family of exported proteins in Plasmodium falciparum known as FITC. I want to understand which surface antigens are transported by the FITC proteins and how. My project involves understanding how humans develop immune responses that can block malaria transmission from the human host to the mosquito vector. The project is very interesting, very exciting, involves a lot of collaborations, involves field work, and in the lab I mostly use flow cytometry, microscopy, genetics, and drug treatments. Elsewhere in the lab, members are using transcriptomics, histology, and microscopy to investigate the parasite in different organs from human autopsies or infected animals. Hi, I'm Matt, I'm a postdoc. Hi, I'm Franzi. I'm German and I'm a postdoc in the lab. Hi, I'm Lauren, I'm from South Scotland, and I'm a PhD student in the Marty Lab, currently the one and only. Hi, I'm João, and I'm from Rio, a Cidade Maravilhosa in Brazil. My research involves the investigation of the Plasmodium vivax reservoir in the bone marrow and spleen and its role in the parasite infection, transmission and disease pathogenesis. This is translational work where we have established a series of patient cohorts in Brazil. Our final goal is to define clinical and translational implications of the parasite infection in the hematopoietic niche. So I'm interested in exploring Plasmodium falciparum novel binding phenotype in the hematopoietic niches of the host. For this, I'll be generating transcriptomic data. I'll also be doing some histological analysis from FFP sample collected from fatal pediatric cerebral malaria cases in Malawi. In my project, I investigate the differences of plasmodium parasites in spleen, bone marrow and blood using single cell RNA-seq and flow cytometry. In a second project that I'm doing, I'm working on something completely different and I'm looking at the knockout that uh, impairs the parasite mosquito development. I'm trying to set up an intravital system to look at uh, the gametocytes in the skin to see how they move, how they behave, uh, and then hopefully we will be able to look at the interactions between uh, the parasite, the host, and also the mosquito. We also have a dedicated computational biologist in the group, Fiona, who runs all of the omics analyses. In addition, we have a technical team that keeps everything in the wet lab in order. Hi, my name is Gillian Parker. I'm from Glasgow and I'm the Marty Group Lab Manager and the Containment Level 3 Manager. Hi, I'm Anna Willem. I'm from Spain. I work as a technician. I carry out different molecular biology techniques such as cloning and transfection. It's my role within the Marty Group to provide a safe and efficient working environment for continuation and continuity of research. 
we contribute with the good functioning of the laboratory, keeping the stock levels as well as pushing consumer well. We work with a number of collaborators here in Glasgow and elsewhere in the UK, in the USA, the Netherlands, Germany and Switzerland. We also collaborate closely in malaria endemic countries such as Malawi, Kenya, Brazil and Panama. During the lockdown, Canon and Lorian also joined the Lighthouse Labs here in Glasgow to help with the testing of COVID-19 patient samples. The group also enjoys traveling to national and international scientific meetings to present their research. Aside from working hard to further our knowledge of the plasmodium parasite and play our part in the elimination and eradication of malaria, we are a group that likes to enjoy themselves. The Marty Group are a great bunch of people with a passion for science and life. They enjoy exercise, food and whiskey. So if you're up for a challenge and lots of fun, come and join us.